Hi everybody, my name is Caroline. In this video, I'm going to show you how to print from your smartphone or tablet to the Canon Selfie CP1300 photo printer. Now, I've covered this printer in a previous video. I will link to that below. That was a setup on how to get this working. And I thank you so much for everybody who watched it. This is kind of a part two of that video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to print from your smartphone without Wi-Fi and without a cable to your Canon selfie printer. Now, this comes in handy if you are going to somebody's house and you want to print some photos while you're there, you're in a party, it's kind of a party mode, or you want to let other people print to your uh, printer without Wi-Fi or without having them get on your Wi-Fi first. To set this up, I am on my selfie printer. It is on, and I'm going to arrow down over to the Wi-Fi settings, select the first selection, connection settings, and that is my printer name. I'm going to say OK. And then I'm going to say Direct Connection. And I'm going to say OK. And this will end the Wi-Fi connection I have going right now. Now it is no longer on Wi-Fi. In essence, it's own mobile hotspot. And let's see, do you want to set a password? This is optional. I'm going to say yes, I want a password. You can change the password. I like having a, a complicated password. I'm going to say OK. And now I'm going to say OK to show password. Now, if I'm at a party and I want to allow my friends to print to my device, I'll tell them to look for the network name, CP1300, and enter in this password so that they can connect wirelessly through my selfie printer and print directly to it. You probably just want to leave it on the screen and then that way people can easily connect to it and print to your selfie printer. First of all, I'm going to go into my settings on my phone and I'm going to go look at my Wi-Fi and I'm going to select the Wi-Fi of my selfie printer, CP1300. I'll enter the password, I'll hit join. And now I am connected to the printer. Now, unfortunately, my phone is no longer connected to the Wi-Fi or to the internet anymore. So you just want to do this temporarily so you can print your picture. I'm going into photos and I'm going to select a photo that I would like to print. Let's see, let's take this photo here and I'm going to hit the box with the arrow and then there should be a choice to print. Here it is, print, hit print. I'm going to select my printer and the Canon selfie comes right up and I'm going to hit print. And it is sending it to the printer right now. and it completed four passes and sure enough here is my photo printed from my smartphone with the Canon selfie printer. This part of the video is for Android phone users. I have a Samsung right here and as you can see the SSID is right here, the password is right here. I am going to go into my Wi-Fi settings and set myself up on this SSID I have put in the password and now I am connecting to the printer wirelessly. And yes, this is correct. I am no longer on my home Wi-Fi. I can no longer con connect to the regular internet. I am now wirelessly connected from my phone to the Canon selfie printer. So I can no longer see the internet, but I can print to this device. And from an Android device, I need one of two apps that I've already downloaded. I showed you how to download this in a previous video. I will link to that below. But assuming you have the app from my last video, I'm gonna go into the Canon Selfie Print app. And I've got my printer. I'm gonna hit Photo Print. I'm gonna select a picture to print. And this is the picture I'd like to print. It's a rainbow. And I'm gonna hit Print. And as you can see, my printer has connected. And the print is starting. And here is my printout of my rainbow and I'm going to peel off the preparations here. And this is a photo printed wirelessly from my Android device to the Canon selfie printer through an Android device. Now I've, I see that my print status is completed. Now that I'm done with this, I'm going to go back in to my Wi-Fi settings and set myself back up on my home Wi-Fi. Don't forget to do that, otherwise you won't be able to access the internet from your phone. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Quick and easy. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. I'll see you next time. Bye now.